Now at 5.30, a gruesome discovery inside a burned-out car. A man's body was found this morning. Firefighters made the discovery after being called to reports of a burning car at about 5 o'clock in the morning. And now the question is, how did that man inside of the car die? CBS 4's Hank Tester is live in North Lauderdale with the latest on the investigation. Hank. Well, that's a question still not solved. This is a quiet little neighborhood park in the middle of Broward County. But tonight, a major crime scene for BSO. Let's take a look. From Chopper 4, you're looking at pictures of Bicentennial Park, North Lauderdale. It was 5 a.m. Residents say they heard shots. Later, the smell of burning rubber. A car was on fire. Next thing you know, we smell smoke. North Lauderdale firefighters got to the car, doused it, and when it cooled down, the car fire became much more. There was a body in the smoking wreckage. BSO had a mysterious homicide case to deal with. When Broward Sheriff's Office deputies were dispatched to the call of a vehicle on fire, North Lauderdale Fire Rescue was also called in. Once the fire was extinguished, they found a male's body in the vehicle. At this time, Broward Sheriff's Office detectives are investigating it as a homicide. Um, we are very early in the stages of the investigation, so it's unclear um, who this person is. Uh, why he was here and the cause of the fire, uh, but they do have an indication that it is a homicide. Police not saying exactly where in the car the body was located, nor exactly how or why the car caught fire. Through most of the morning, deputies looking for clues, putting evidence markers around the crime scene. Officers searched the nearby recreation center. Gunshots rang out. About, I heard about two or three of them. And me and my husband were like, what was that? So we looked back outside and we didn't see anything, but we heard a car squealing off. Lots of forensics to go on this particular uh, case for BSO, the body currently at the medical examiner's office. That's the very latest. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News. Back to you.